you said just last sentence you said cybernetic solutions are available and they are viable aren't they yes of course i think that eventually the the whole world i was thinking about this last night because of a, another talk that i have tomorrow eventually we are all going to cybernetics eventually yeah, yeah because I agree. <clears throat> people when they, when they really find out that socialism doesn't work, they're going to have to go back to capitalism. How do we improve capitalism? Okay? How yes. do we make it work for everybody? And there's only one answer. To make capitalism work for everybody, you have to share information with everybody. Simple as that. I agree. With everybody. I agree. No more secrets. And in order to have... Corporations that have no secrets, that have to share, uh, you can do that. And there are levels where you can keep information and levels where you can share. And then levels where you keep and levels where you share. It's all in the recursions, okay? How you handle the recursions. Yeah. And people are one-on-one. -on -one to, I, I, as a politician, I'm talking to you. People want honesty, and you cannot get honesty without sharing information. And you cannot get sharing information without total transparency. And you cannot get transparency unless information flows freely. And it won't flow freely if you don't have a structure like the viable system, universal management or something that else that comes out that has the structure to share without an overload of the channels. Okay. Yeah without overloading and without gaps. The universal management is about finding the gaps in the information flows and finding the bottlenecks in the information flows. Yeah. And then you can go in and design the amplificators, the amplifiers, sorry, and the filters. Yeah. And you know very well that it is a balance, okay? How, how much do we have to invest to get this and how much not, you know, how, how much or, and, and that sort of questions. Yeah, exactly. So I, I think that eventually the, the capitalist system, you're going to have informed buyers, okay? The, I would expect the, the world to become more sophisticated and, and, and that we could use cybernetics as an everyday language. And this is one of the reasons I just refuse the petitions of some of my friends and possible future partners that we keep the cybernetics hidden and they would just give the solutions. I want to change the culture. Okay. I want to change the world. Okay. <laughs> so well, you then I can, the world I can shake it. The, the, the really important stuff. Okay. I can shake your hands on that because I think the same thing and I try and I'm, really really uh i'm busy to and i understand now by by physics the law of physics that if you do not share all information chaos is the direct result entropy and yes. i think that is a an understandable law of physics that we should you know promote more to understand that people if they really try to escape reality well, by lying because, that something happens that they cannot control yeah, anything but, but 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 here is something that i, I want to share also yeah i went to the Santa Fe Institute, in, I've been there, I think, three times. But the first time I went there, I, I had the privilege of, of, of meeting Chris, Chris Langton, one of the creators of the artificial life thing. And I was very worried about Mexico, and I explained to him that I saw something really bad coming. Well, two days later came the devaluation of 1994, which was terrific for Mexico, you know. We wiped away the... 20% of the internal gross national product or whatever. Mm -hmm. but, but he told me when I said information, and he said, yes, you need information, but it's not about sharing everything to everybody. He was meaning that you need structures, okay? It's not like you have to know everything that's going on in the world. No. It just doesn't happen. Now, in our legal system, the law, our law in Mexico, following the Napoleonic Code, assumes that you know all the law, and if you break it, it's because you were acting in that faith. It was your obligation to know the law, okay? Yes. 
So here is this assumption that we know cannot, is not possible. So then again, this is an argument that we want transparency, but it ha this sharing of information has to do, has to be done through the proper channels so that people that want to be informed can be informed. But if you are expert in energy, maybe you don't want to deal with expert in, 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 in uh, making clothes, you know, or, exactly. or some other thing. And no, exactly. I think what, what we do, maybe we should just uh, say, okay, we have the information and we need information. When we have a purpose, we need information to get that goal, isn't it? That's the cybernetic way. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, so then we can use relevant, I, I call it relevant information to achieving a goal, you know, maximum volume of irrelevant information which is needed to achieve a goal, for example, of a, uh, you know, a balanced uh, government or a, uh, you know, corona crisis uh, answer, for, so, for example. Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, the, the coronavirus is, is I've, I've seen it as an information game. You know, yeah. of missing information. Exactly. I, I don't know same. why the world hasn't celebrated the fact that we're going to get a test that will tell you 15 minutes if you have the virus or not. <laughs> I don't know. It, it's absolutely irrelevant because right now, if you have it, you can go on spreading the virus 15 days before you know you have it. And yeah. this delay in the system, okay, yeah, is a killer. That kills you kills a lot of people. The Ebola, which is many, many times more mortal yeah. than, than, the, than, the, um, Corona, yeah. than the coronavirus, didn't kill as many people simply because it evolved so suddenly that the person dies in a day or a couple of days, so you know where it is and you can control, you can isolate that person, okay? Before you start being a, a source of contamination. Or, or an infection, but this thing takes 14 days. That delay is is really makes it really mortal. So if you have a 15 minute test, I think that the virus is going to be defeated through the testing of a very inexpensive 15 minute test worth five dollars. Yeah, well, I hope uh, that um, this uh, Corona crisis, which now is being guided by interests, not by information, you know, <laughs> by public or uh, governmental interests or, go or corporate interests. And that I think is uh, really, really harming the stability of social cohesion. And that is, I think, a good way to conclude our conversation today. Uh, if you have anything to add, please go. Because, and then- Well, we, we, we just tell our viewers, if anybody's yeah. watching, that we were going to talk a little about uh, the nature of information and yeah. quantum bits and all that. We will leave that for another time. Okay. Yes. Yes. So yeah, the next time uh, we because there's so much to talk about, but the the physical and natural and and the cognitions uh, in, input we can do in a in a later time. This was a first op just an open conversation. Great to meet you. Great to talk to you all the way overseas over the other. And I, I appreciate very much that you have watched my stuff. Yes. I hope everybody would do that. More people would do that. Uh, well, I'm sharing I'm this with my network. Many sure. right now. Uh, on the thing that I'm, maybe I'm too politicized and people don't want my conclusions. But anyway, thank you very much. It's been a real pleasure and I yes. hope to see you again. Yes. Well, uh, yeah, we, we can do this uh, anytime uh, you like. If you have any news, we can share it uh, like this uh, to, to, to enlarge the... Uh, yeah, well, the you, you tell me when we continue with the other half of our initial intention. Yeah. Okay. And I'll be glad to hear about what you have to say about the uh, bits and qubits. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you okay. very much. Okay. Mucho, Goodbye. Mucho gusto. Gracias. Igualmente. Bye. Adiós. Hasta luego. Pronto. Hasta pronto. Hasta pronto. Hasta pronto. Sí, sí. Espero.